Hi. Bearing is the most common element in any technology nowadays, from cars to skateboards to even power plants have bearings in them. But what is a bearing? A bearing is a machine element that will reduce the friction and make the rotation smooth. A wide variety of bearing designs exist to allow the demands of the application to be correctly met for maximum efficiency, reliability, durability, and performance. It also adds as a support to maintain the correct position for the rotation shaft. However, bearings are vulnerable due to support and always in the state of rotating while the machine works. It tends to wear out and sooner or later, the machine will undergo full paralysis due to poor health of bearing. That's where fault detection for the bearing is needed, which are to predict the health of the bearings, whether in the state of healthy or poor, reducing the maintenance cost of the machine, and thus preventing the machine to go full paralysis, which can lead to catastrophe failure. Besides, one of the ways to detect bearing faults is by using vibration signals from vibration analysis. Vibration analysis is a process that monitors the levels and patterns of vibration within the bearing components, detects the abnormal vibrations, and be able to evaluate the overall condition of the bearing. So, the overall methods are divided by two, which is using the time domain statistical features and also fuzzy logic. I will explain each method equally. We use MATLAB software to extract raw data from the vibration signals of the ball bearing regarding the vibration patterns when certain faults is applied. For instance, a graph can be plotted by using the data such as defect depth changes by time. Moreover, a signal graph of the bearing acceleration of a healthy bearing and a poor bearing can be determined and showed in the same figure to draw conclusions between two signals which ease the finding of vibration abnormalities. Moreover, further data analysis such as signal spectrogram, calculating the peak frequency and mean peak frequency is used for conditional monitoring too. Next, we use fuzzy logic. Fuzzy logic has been used for the past 60 years in mechanisms such as uh, automatic braking system in cars, washing machines, and also rice cookers. It was first advanced by Dr. Lotfi Zadeh in the 1960s, working on the problems for computers to understand the natural language. Fuzzy logic is an approach to computing based on degrees of truth rather than the usual true or false which is binary in 1 or 0, which that is Boolean logic. In this project, we use Adaptive Neural Fuzzy Interference System, or AMFIS, which will classify the various defects in the bearing, has high reliability in fault detection, and predict a more accurate fault time operation. Hence, an app will be developed for the industrial use in the future. That is all from me. Thank you for lending me your time and ears. Terima kasih dan arigatou gozaimasu.